time for this week's pick of the litter brought to us by Best Mattress. Great news for those working breed dogs in the local shelter system. The Nevada SPCA and Vegas Shepherd Rescue are now collaborating. Lori Heron, Executive Director of the Nevada SPCA, is here along with our former EP on the Morning Blend, Julie Pyle, also the co-founder of Vegas Shepherd Rescue, along with the very handsome Pop Smoke, aka Smokey, <laughs> an adoptable German Shepherd who is being taken care of by the NSPCA. Ladies, welcome in. Thank you. Good morning. Good, Good morning. morning. I am thrilled to hear that you have created a new program. Tell us all about it. Well, JJ, I think it's important, especially what's going on right now with the animal rescue community. We're all overwhelmed that we all work together. And this is a new collaboration with Vegas Shepherd Rescue. They are the experts in dealing with these working breed dogs. And we mm -hmm. see so many of them in the shelter that just need some extra attention so that we can modify any of those behaviors so they're really good in their new adoptive home. So we were excited when Julie reached out with her team um, to work with us and help us with so many of these working breed dogs that are coming into our shelter, like Pop Smoke. He's so sweet. So when you say working breed, what breeds are we talking about exactly? We're talking about German Shepherds, Dutch Shepherds, Belgian Malinois, Rottweilers, Dobermans. Yeah. Actually, the I big boys. Those are the big, big boys. Big <laughs> That's right. And Julie, you have so much experience with these dogs. I mean, look at this loving, loving Hi, Smokey sweet. right here. <laughs> so you'll be really working on training because if you can help train a dog, it is more adoptable, essentially, right? A lot of them, when they come into the shelter system, um, they're they're good dogs, but they're fearful. They don't understand what's happening, Aww. and and so they can act out. So a Chihuahua can act the same way, mm -hmm. but the Chihuahua doesn't have the ability to really hurt you like the the bigger breeds do um, so yeah our goal yeah. is to work with them to to find what makes them click what makes them more adoptable so that they can go home more quickly yeah and how did this collaboration all come about where was the need there that you guys sought to fill well Vegas Shepherd Rescue unfortunately closed um, its doors after 11 years um, but I didn't want the dogs to suffer um, because rescues are more hesitant to take them in because they're harder to place, they're harder to rehabilitate rehabilitate. Mm -hmm. uh, so I approached Lori because I've always had a lot of respect for the NSPCA and said, hey, would you be interested in starting starting this program with me? A lot of respect and a lot of history, Julie, because you really held up this segment, Pick of the Litter, on the Morning Blend for more than a decade. Uh, and we saw dozens, if not hundreds of dogs adopted. So this is a perfect fit, I feel. Yeah. Can we shine a light for a moment on Smokey? Because Smokey <laughs> is ready for a home. We hear he's three years old. He has been so loved since he walked through the doors of the station. He's really a, a great boy, JJ. He uh, is, um, as you said, three years old. He's about 60 pounds. Uh, he's a calm boy. He would do well in a variety of homes. Um, he's been with us for a couple of weeks. He is an owner surrender, as are many of the animals that come into us. You know, we see so many scenarios with these working breed dogs where the owners just don't have the time and commitment um, to work with them um, on their training so that it's really a good fit for their homes. And that's why our new um, relationship with Julie and her team of experts is so important to help dogs like um, Pop Smoke here really have a positive experience with their new family. Absolutely. And so what types of challenges are you really seeing when it comes to rehoming uh, working breed dogs? So we have so many um, working breed dogs right now in the shelter. I mean, if you go to our website, you're going to see German Shepherds, you're going to see Huskies, um, so many animals that are larger animals that just didn't get the um, commitment and the attention from their prior family. Mm -hmm. um, and of course, there are certainly situations where the family was in need. I mean, we're seeing a lot of financial need. So there's so many of them right now and we wanna be able to help as many as possible. So any opportunities for us to get additional support from especially people with the expert um, experience like Julie's team is just so valuable in saving more lives. Absolutely. Speaking of saving lives, we wanna, let people know that they can reach out to adopt Smokey. Smokey is available for adoption at NSPCA. 
Julie, real quick before yeah. we go, thank you for being on our 13th anniversary show. <laughs> thank you. It wouldn't be back. the same without you here. It, any memories that you'd like to share? Because you've spent a lot of time <laughs> in this building and so on the show. So many, so many. But I have to say the one that stands out the most, and I, I, I don't remember the year, but I remember the date. It was January 26th. We lost power to the building. Um, oh so the studio was generated, um, <laughs> or had generators going so, so that we were able to go on air. But we had no computer, oh, no. <laughs> no teleprompter. Oh, wow. um, I had printed off scripts prior to that. But my bosses were like, are you sure you want to go on air? We can just slip in an old show. And I was like, I have recycled percussion or um, what was their name? Recycled percussion here. I said, yeah. girls on stilts. I have drummers. I have all these, it's, you know, green room full the of people. Show must the go show on. must the go show on. <laughs> well, don't you know, the girls on the stilts were uh, like in this side frame and then all of a sudden one of them went Wah, and fell oh, over and fell out of frame but well, she was fine she was fine <laughs> i know that clip very well it's actually <laughs> it's actually got thousands of views on youtube uh, you know if someone adopts smoky they will receive a complimentary pet bed from best mattress so thank you ladies so much reach out to the nevada spca to learn more about smoky and their working breed program you can adopt volunteer and donate nevada spca.org